Hello, Nadine here, sharing a card I created for the Imagine Crafts and Casual Fridays Block Hop. The first thing I'm going to do is layer up some white cardstock on top of black cardstock. And then on the other is a, my, the orange piece is from Bow Bunny, the Believe Collection. And then using my Misty stamp tool, I'm going to figure out where I want my stamp. The stamp I'm going to be using is from Casual Fridays. It is the Truth Is collection. Once I figure out where I want that lined up onto the paper, I'm going to use a Memento Tuxedo Black. Get it nice and stamped well, inked up well. And then I'm going to re-stamp the image. This is what the Misty tool is great for. So you can line up exactly where you want it onto the orange piece of paper. And now using the Casual Fridays Truth Bloom dies, using a little piece of washi tape and a Spellbinders Platinum die cut machine. And cut out the one flower. And then I'm going to go back and do the same for the smaller flower. And as you can see, I'm actually cutting through the black and the white cardstock at the same time because I'm going to end up pop dotting that up over the orange piece of paper. Now using some Radiant Neon, Amp Neon Amplify in Electric Orange, I'm filling in the petals of the flower. And then when you heat up the Amplify, you can see how it puffs up. Now using some Irresistible Pico Embellisher in Tuxedo Black, I'm just going to go and outline over the stamp. I messed up there a little bit. It's best to have like a paper towel or something just to get it started on there before you go and outline because sometimes it will do a little bubble which you saw that it did there on that one little lower flower. I'll set that aside to dry. Now using one of the sentiments from the stamp collection and the kaleidoscope or kaleidocolor desert heat It gives it a really fun ombre effect. Now outlining the stems with the Pico embellisher. And I didn't, I wanted to do a little ribbon bow on the bottom of the flower stems, but I didn't have the right color um, twine. So I actually used the Kaleidocolor ink and put it onto the, the twine. Now just heating it up so it dries, tied it into a cute little bow, and glued it on there. Now taking some pop dots for 3D foam squares, and lining up over the top of the orange piece of paper. Now I'm going to adhere this to my black card base. And then at the very end, I use some Cloud9 rain dots. I don't even know if they make those anymore in orange, just to give it a fun little look. And then I was done. That is my card. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you liked, please like the video and subscribe. Thank you for watching.